Year 11 leadership course is the culmination of the college's outdoor program. Leadership really follows on from Endeavour in that it's in the West McDonald Ranges and it happens over a 10 day period. Yeah, my, my main fear was, um, you know, repeating what I'd done in previous camps, which was becoming negative. <laughs> so for year 11, I thought, right, this is my last, you know, big school camp. I want to have fun. Uh, so I, I came in with that mentality of I want to be positive, I want to have fun, and I just stuck with it. The school sort of offers it as a leadership program. Students expecting to be leaders within the college are actually involved and take on or plan to take on leadership roles the following year. I think the best quality it taught me was uh, being able to communicate with people. Um, that's a big part of being a leader and it's something that I wasn't very strong in. To become a good leader I needed to you know take these qualities that I'm not very good at and work on them and improve them and leadership camp was a great opportunity to learn and hone those skills and it served me well in later life. After the first day the leadership is passed over to the students where they're then responsible for all safety briefing, keeping the group together, navigation, all leadership decisions including using a variety of different leadership styles at different times throughout the day, monitoring water and hygiene and cooking um, and their impact on the environment as well. I sit and do nothing. I observe. I observe the stillness of the trees, with only the leaves swaying from side to side. I feel the rocks beneath my feet, and as I walk on them, the rocks grind together. I feel the sun heating up the rocks, and when I touch the rocks, a wave of heat, like a pulse, enters my body, spreading from my fingertips down to the bottom of my feet. There is definitely a day where you'll see some of the most bizarre kind of combination of equipment and landscape, and that's definitely when the students travel through Hugh Gorge. Woo! Yeah! What a go! Gorge travel itself is quite amazing, and they go through a series of around six to seven pools of water, some of them up to 70 metres in length. That's it! I so want to catch the, catch the fall off. The 48 hour solo is runs for days seven and eight, and then there's another two days where the students are effectively shadowed by their instructors. There's so many uh, parts of leadership camp that are so beneficial. Like it's not it's not necessarily about you know the the walking and the journey. It's about what happens on it. Uh, Self reflection times, the, the, the times you have to think about stuff and. What, what you're getting out of it and what it means to you and that's all really, really beneficial.